Hello guys, this is Amos Doll Music, and in today's lesson, I'm going to teach you how to play Dancing in the Moonlight, okay? So, this lesson is particularly sponsored by Ramsey O. It's a special lesson that teaches this particular section and particular version of this song, okay? Really catchy motifs, goes like this. Give you a preview before we start learning it. Check it out. that section okay so let's learn it right now this particular version is um, played like this okay so we're gonna break it up or up to the notes uh, right hand and left hand separately and you know exactly where to play each note and how to kind of like execute it okay it's actually not as hard as you think it is once we break it up into pattern learning okay so right hand starts on the C one octave above middle C okay so to go up here it goes uh, okay we'll break it up into let me see one about seven parts, okay? Okay, first part goes like this, starting on the C up here, so middle C, go up an octave C, so two Cs, up to E flat, and then down, more than an octave, down to a quadruple note, four notes, it's like an A flat major seven chord, it's A flat C, E flat G, yeah, and then it goes a triple note, A flat C, F, it's like a first inversion F minor twice, and then it goes to A flat major, kind of like triad, which is a flat C E flat and triple note and then it goes A flat single note and that's it for the elements of this first part okay there are seven parts as I said so just slowly practice each part like that okay so two C's up to E flat and then down to a quadruple note A flat C E flat G down here and then triple note A flat C F twice and then triple note A flat C E flat once and then one A flat like that Okay, so da, 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 da. okay, so that's the first part for the right hand. Left hand, uh, this is what we have. Okay, most of the parts are very easy. It's like a rhythmic pattern. Okay, you go on your lowest F on your piano, so lowest F, and then octave above F, and then back down to the lower octave F, and then repeat that F again, and then up to the higher F. So yeah. Most of the left hand bass in all of the parts of this lesson is always using this rhythmic pattern. So just practice like dum ba 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 like that. It's kind of like a drum, okay? I can't beatbox, but you get the point. Focus on that rhythm and it will be a lot easier to learn. So like bum ba bum bum ba like that. Okay, where the lower is like a bum ba bum bum ba rather than just thinking of the notes, okay? Think of the rhythm. The low, high, low, low, high. Okay, that's the first part. Okay, so remember this rhythm because a lot of the other parts for the left hand is like a different like octave bass, but it's the same rhythm, okay? It will help you a lot. Okay, now, right hand starts off this first part, so it goes da da da, then right hand, and then left hand comes here. Together, 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 here. Like that. Okay, one more time. So da da da, da left, together, together, together. Like that. Okay, so. Da, da, da. Like that when it's faster. Like that. Alright, now moving on to the second part. Right hand continues, double note, B flat F. D, C, and then that B flat F again. D, C, B flat up to E flat G, double note. And that's it for this second part for the right hand. One more time, it goes B flat F, double note. D, C, B flat, F double note. D, C, B flat, up to E flat, G double note. That's it. When it's faster. Like that. That's it for the right hand. Left hand, we have the exact same rhythmic pattern we learned in the first part. So, but this time it's with B flat octave, okay? So, low B flat, high B flat, low B flat, low B flat again, and high B flat, like that. So remember that uh, rhythm is a boom, ba, boom, boom, ba, like that. Remember that? So do that exact same rhythm, but with the B flat. Okay, two hands together goes like this, goes together, 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 whoops, let's try again, so more like together, 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 like that, like that, okay, so do it slower one more time, so together, 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 okay, and the one is faster, like that. 
boom. Remember the boom, ba, boom, boom, ba. Yeah, so if you think of it as like boom, ba, boom, ba, ba, it's a lot easier to remember for the left hand, okay? And the right hand will come easily. Like that, okay? Now, moving on to the third part, okay? Third part, right hand continues, goes uh, triple note, B flat, G, and high B flat, twice. And triple note, C, G, C, twice. And that's it. So really easy, just like two triple notes twice. Like that. Okay? Yeah. Practice that a few times. That's the third part of the right hand. Left hand. Uh, yeah, this time, the rhythm, it's like splitting up into two halves of the boom, ba, boom, boom, ba, boom. This time it's like that because it's changing two bass notes. So you're only doing half of that pattern instead of boom, ba, boom, boom, ba. It's just boom, ba, boom. So boom, ba, boom, boom, ba, boom, like that this time. Okay, so it goes the E flat one, low, high, low, and then the D, high, low, like that. Like that, low, high, low for E flat, and then the D, low, high, low. So this time it's boom, ba, boom, boom, ba, boom, like that, okay? So it's different rhythm this time, okay? It's like, not different rhythm, it's the same, but it's only half of that pattern played uh, for each of the uh, bass notes. So boom, ba, boom, boom, ba, boom, okay? So remember that for this third part. Okay, easy to remember as pattern rhythms. Okay, here we go. So two hands together goes like this. So it goes left starts off and then skida skida here and then right hand continues and together like that, like that. So it goes skida skida here here skida like that. All right. So skida skida here skida. Okay. When it's faster, like that. Okay, so bum, 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 bum. Oops. So it's like bum, 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 like that. Okay. So really coordinate the rhythm with the right hand. So, bum, 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 so. All right. So yeah. Now moving on to the uh, four, fourth part. Okay. The fourth part is pretty much the same as the first part, but the right hand changes a little bit. Uh, this time it goes triple note C G B flat, and then it goes triple note C G C, and then it goes triple note E flat G E flat, then it goes uh, let me see. down to the yeah this the same thing which is the quadruple note the A flat C E flat G, then it goes. The two triple notes A flat C F twice, and then A flat C E flat triple note once, and then one A flat. So yeah, it's pretty much the same thing as the first part, but just with more left hand notes and the right hand notes as well. Okay, so triple note C G B flat, triple note C G C, and then triple note E flat G E flat, and down to the quadruple note, and then the A flat C F triple note two times, and then the A flat C E flat triple note once, and then A flat. Okay. There you go. Okay. However, this time more left hand notes. So first of all, we have the boom ba boom boom ba for C bass note, which we haven't done this time. So it goes low C, high C, low C, low C, high C. Okay. But with the rhythm, remember the boom ba boom boom ba. Okay. And then, and then you continue to the F uh, pattern, which you learned before. Boom ba boom. boom ba. So yeah, two patterns for this one. So the C pattern of the boom ba boom boom ba, and then F. Pattern, boom, ba, boom, boom, ba, like that. Okay, so two hands together goes like this here. Okay, and the right hand comes in, left hand comes in, and together, together, right hand comes in, and then left hand, together, 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 right hand comes in. There you go. Okay, one is faster, so it's more like. Okay, so it's like Okay, one is faster Yeah, it does take some time to practice the coordination So go slow and build up your speed, okay? Okay Then something awesome happens The uh, next part, this fifth part uh, it's actually exactly the same as the second part. So everything is the same. So the, back to the Okay, 
So all these easy is exactly the same as the second part. Okay, so okay. Then the next part, the sixth part is actually exactly the same as well. Okay, so we just save some time once again. It's the same as the third part. Okay, the like that. Simple stuff. There you go. So it's like there you go. Okay, so it's not difficult at all. There's the pattern that you have to master. The bum 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 bum. Okay, bum 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 bum. And then that pattern, uh, the pattern that goes dum bum 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 bum. The half half pattern. Okay, so that's the thing that you master the rhythmic pattern of the left hand. Practice the left hand rhythmic pattern by itself. Practice the right hand notes by itself, and then put it together slowly. Build up the speed slowly, and then it'll be very easy. Okay, so yeah, so. So yeah, and afterwards you can experiment with your own patterns if you want as well. You can be like, you can be like, that's more like arpeggio patterns. It's still the same thing. It's all about counting. So that's why the method is so good. It's like unlimited like variations if you know how to count the rhythms really good. Okay, so rhythm mastery. But as for now, hope you enjoyed this lesson of this particular section of dancing in the moonlight. And as for now, that's pretty much it for today's. Lesson. If you enjoyed this lesson, make sure to check out the rest of my channel because literally there are multiple thousands and thousands of these videos ranging from pop songs of all languages, meme songs, video game music, movie, anime, and cartoon theme songs, and many more songs of all sorts that I teach. So most likely you can find your favorite song to learn on my channel. Also check out my website, bestpianomethod.com, linked in the description below if you want to learn more piano from me. Learn from my piano courses on how to play by ear, improvise, read sheet music, how to play and sing, and many more courses at all types of levels, even for those who have never touched a piano before. As for now, enjoy your time around my channel and see you next time.